Hello, welcome back to Phoenix Wright, everybody. Events on Dusky Bridge, let's go. Welcome back to Miles Edgeworth. Is no, that, that game that <laughs> game comes later. That comes later, Edgeworth. Actually, there's an eyewitness who was there when the incident took place. This photo was accidentally taken by the witness. It shows the Vic wearing the scarf, sir. And it was drizzling that day. Unfortunately, it's a little hard to see what's going on. Anyway! The criminal shoved the victim down from behind and stabbed her in the back. That must have been Ow. when the scarf fell off. Stabbed her in the back? <sighs> Looking at this photo... You really get the sense that this bridge is very high up. I really get the sense that this judge needs to be replaced. I'm, I'm getting the sense of who took that picture, by the way. That, that's also a good a question. It's a 40 foot drop from the bridge to the Eagle River down below. Mr. Edgeworth, who took this photo anyway? Lady Edelgard. Wait. <laughs> Edelgard? The second, the second you hear Eagle. Oh, Black Eagles! Edelgard. <laughs> Reach for my hand. That. Let's soar away. I'll soar away, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say that it was a well intentioned bird party. Aha! A potential witness! So why isn't this per person in the courtroom? Well, they said they absolutely did not want to testify. So they're pleading the fest. Yes. The person in question is very delicate. Besides, as long as we have a, had this photo, we have no reason to compel them to testify. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Make a- I, I, This guy's worse than the judge. <laughs> <laughs> I am a judge, you fuck! The other judge. So, so as you can see, Terry Bogart has- had both the motive Bogart. and the opportunity. Are you okay? Bust a wolf! Now do that in Johnny Bravo's voice. <laughs> Are you okay? Bust a wolf! Oh my god. I, f I think it's quite clear that at this point what happened on that bridge. Are you okay? Bust a wolf! Hmm. <laughs> Aha! The truth is becoming clear to me now! Yes, guilty. it's quite obvious he's clearly guilty. Oh my god. Oh my god. Not again. It's not fair. Wait, what are you, a six year old child? I haven't even done my cross examination yet. What do you mean? It feels like he doesn't want to be here. I want to go home and look at head tie. Here's a big one. Bust a wolf! Actually, there was an eyewitness who took the who was there when the when the incident took place. But it was accidentally taken by the witness. It shows the Vic clearly wearing the wearing the scarf. Yes, I can see it. Okay. It was drizzling that day. Unfortunately, it's a little hard to see what's going on. It's not that hard to see. Take it by the witness. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. What? Never mind. Keep going. Anyway, the criminal shook the victim down from behind. I call bullshit. Press, um, no, press present, it. Time, time the, I was gonna say present evidence, but okay. No. Oh. Yeah, can we have, look at the photo one more time. The crime photo. Or that one that works. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, yeah, the crime photo. She looks. It, I don't know why, but that looks dry. It doesn't look like it's raining. Well, I mean. I don't think it's. it's well, I mean, it's hard to tell from. But because it's black and white. True, okay, but look just... at the look at the other photo. You can tell it's raining there. Yes. But then more that's just a shadow. What's this okay, photo? Let's just Oh. Let's just let's just press but, wait, 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 wait. Just press it in the north north. Never mind. What is it? I mean, Lord, what do you want me to do? No, I, I... Say, present the crime photo because if she fell, then she should be muddy. Mm. Uh, 
present. It was this one, right? Um, oh no, the other one, the other one? That's the one. The car one. This one. Alright. Oh, you're right! Hey. She's probably gonna- she's probably gonna explain it better than I can. That's just gonna be it. <laughs> so at the time of the crime, there was a light drizzle coming down, correct? Yeah, and fog too. Just generally- just a generally soggy atmosphere. If it was foggy, then how come that- how come that picture is clear? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> well, I have evidence that doesn't go with the soggy atmosphere. But this is a photo of the victim's body that was found in the tr car trunk. Considering the conditions at the scene of the crime, something isn't right. Well, by all means, please enlighten us as to what isn't right. Uh, well, you could use her head. What is it about this photo of the trunk? Oh, okay. It doesn't- Uh, I'd say the, um... The bulging the nipple. No. <laughs> Just the coat in general. Alright, fine. Naturally, the answer is... RIGHT HERE! The victim's coat? As far as I can see, there's nothing strange about it. That's exactly what's strange. Recall the testimony where... What were the conditions on that bridge that day? It was drizzling and foggy. Dusky bridge was all wet. If the victim really had fallen down her stomach on the top of that bridge... Then the front of her coat should have been covered in mud. Ah. Uh, uh, that's exactly right! The other day I fell on a muddy street and my gorgeous playoff beard was befooled. befouled. Why are you talking about that? Objection! Objection! I do admit that the crime scene was quite wet that day. However, that doesn't mean that the top of the bridge itself was not. If your honor has fall if your if your if your honor had fallen in the shower instead of a muddy street, your glorious hockey beard, part of the legal league, would be wet and but not muddy. I like how this guy thinks. Fortunately, I had yet to test that. Still, your point is well taken. <laughs> My God. Can you prove that the surface of the bridge was muddy that day? Yeah, the scarf says otherwise. The surface of the bridge, huh? Heh, <laughs> a real man wouldn't stand for a taunt like this. Neither would a real woman. Of course I can! <laughs> Scarf. Here is the evidence that proves the surface of the bridge was money. Take that! <laughs> Take that! <laughs> The evidence is this scarf. Oh! It should be obvious. If the scarf fell onto the bridge and got this muddy, it means that the bridge was obviously covered in mud. No! <laughs> no, I can't be outwitted by this nov novice bimbo. <laughs> well then! Aren't you a novice bimbo? Hey, same to you, buddy. This face assertion makes perfect sense to me. Objection! Objection! I do admit that there was, there appears to be a contradiction between the condition of the victim's coat and her scarf. However, the real question is, why is the, why is there a, con there a contradiction? Huh? For every contradiction, there exists an explanation. Let's look at what the, the explanation in this case may be, shall we? Alright. It's not like he's really giving me a choice here. Ha. <laughs> You're doing pretty well for a little kitten. M Mr. Armando, stop calling me that. No. No matter what he says, a contradiction always comes down to a lie. It's either the victim discovered it in the trunk, 
a witness's photo showing the defendant and the victim, or the witness's testimony that stated she saw the moment of the murder. Just relax and think it over. It's pretty simple, isn't it? False evidence. It's one of those three. They heard him. <laughs> what you said just now, I'm not sure I like that. Th th that wasn't me, Your Honor. It was the coffee aficionado over there, <laughs> over here, who had said that. This court is not in the habit of accepting false evidence, you know. This court is not it's in the habit of sending coffees to this guy either. Blame it on him, Your Honor. He's the one trying to slip false evidence into the court. Mm. We won't let him. Let's expose his evidence as flip. Ah, as the flimsy scammy really is. Yes! The false evidence in this case is the... The witness's testimony. I'd say the testimony because, well... Uh, it's, it's hard to explain, but it's like... She said she witnessed the moment of the murder, but, but... in the photo... But in the photo, it doesn't. It says otherwise. So I'd say she's lying. The photo's not. It is a no-brainer. Obviously, it's the witness that's suspicious. During his earlier testimony, the detective pointed out a crucial fact: the criminal shoved the victim down from behind and stabbed her in the back. Now. And is that testimony exactly what the witness claims to have seen? Yeah, that's what the witness told us. <laughs> that testimony is filled with holes. Copyrighted music. <laughs> and also copyright. About time. I was wondering when that was going to show up. After all, the victim's coat isn't dirty at all. Hmm, that's true! Ha, <laughs> it's not just true, it's the truth. If there is truly a decisive witness in this case, I'm certain that boy wander over there could would have called them to the in the first place. Your Honor, the defense requests to cross-examine the eyewitness. The testimony presented so far is n not only vague, but contradictory as well. Objection. Well, Mr. Edgeworth, it appears that we'll need to hear from your te- From your test mystery witness after all. Why am I being testified? <laughs> you should brace yourself for the brutal truth. Bitch. Your Honor, the prosecution has no intention of hiding the witness from the court. We are prepared to present our, ev wit uh, our evidence <laughs> our witness at any time. The witness's evidence. <laughs> Very well. Please bring forth your witness at this time. What Mr. Edgeworth said kind of worries me. What does he mean by the brutal truth? Now, let's proceed with the testimony. Mr. Edgeworth, please go right ahead. Thank you, Your Honor. The prosecution summons the woman who saw the events of that day with her very own eyes. This is it, Mia. The battle begins here. It's him! What witness? Oh, shit. What is your... Witness, what is your name and occupation? Hi there! Oh. I'm back, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone Hello? is so Lord, we already saw her. Everyone is so silent that I can't hear their hearts going pitter patter. I want a pitter patter all over you tits. Oh when I look at you, how can I put it? You look as scrumptious as a double double and a dozen donut holes. Pardon? Me? <laughs> what? I feel like I want to hurry up and head down a verdict just to have a bite. 
Hey, hey, not so fast. <sighs> As I said before, the witness is very sensitive and delicate. I would ask the court to please exercise care when addressing her. Yes, indeed. Thank you, Mr. Edgy Boy. You are a true gentleman and a dickhole. Uh, a contempt on court for the judge. <laughs> Bitch, I can contempt you right now! Miss Faye, you could Taylor? learn a lot from this man! Your Honor, you could learn a lot from that man too. If he's such a great, such a gentleman, he sure doesn't act like one to me. I say the judge is rigged. <laughs> Sir? Uh, yes, my dear? my first time, so I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'll make a lot of mistakes. Anyway, I just wanted to say I'm sorry for all the trouble I might cause. <sighs> Not at all, it's no trouble at all! Now then, Zip. can we please have your name and occupation? Oh, Zip's it's pants. my job. My name is, um, Melissa Fo Fo Foster. Bullshit. Nah, it must be true. It's not like we ever met this person anyway, right? Nah, not at all. Flashback. <laughs> college student. Okay. I'm a college student. Freshman in the literature department. <laughs> the literature department? Doki doki literature If only Scooter was oh, here to God. make a joke about that! Yeah. Don't worry, I got you, you Scooter. On the, you were on the scene when the unfortunate event occurred. Correct? And you were the one who took the, this photo? Is that accurate? Miss Faye! What, what the- ah! How can you be so mean? Jesus Christ! Now see here, what are you doing shoving her and shoving that in her face like that? Huh? But it's just a photograph. It's not like it's something dangerous. Pa of course. Paper cuts! Next time I'll be forced to penalize you! You're not- oh you won't be God. forced to do anything! Uh oh, I don't like the turn this has taken. I don't like the judge. I don't like you, Nickton! Is she staring at me? Um, and you would be? Huh? I'm the defense attorney. My name is Mia Fey. Hmm. Bitch. <laughs> I see, so you are. No, this no, is cut off. This gets cut off. Could you please give us your testimony? Yes. No, you are. You <laughs> yes, are. I'll do. Uh, yes, you are. I'll do my best. Get in my chambers. No, I'll do my no. best. <laughs> I I was using the cam my camera to take some pictures of the wildflowers. And I noticed there was two people standing on up on the suspicious suspicion bridge. Sus suspension bridge. Suspension. Suspicion. Sus sus suspension bridge. Suddenly they just started fighting. That's why I hurried and took the photo of the crucial. Oh. But uh, okay. Uh, what crucial moment? Yeah. What crucial moment? And after that, and right after that, I called the police. <laughs> By the way, where were you standing when the incident occurred? It's pretty obvious where she was standing. Near the bridge! I believe the map will be a help with you. I was standing right over here. I was standing in a beautiful field surrounded by tall cliffs. That sounds dangerous, but okay. Talk close to So you took the photo from that location, eh? I bought the camera when I was using it at the time, just like Mr. Hitchworth asked me to do. To. Oh, 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 what a cute camera, just like its owner! No, we're not doing Frieza. Fuck off with that. <laughs> Fine. Melissa Foster took the witness's photo with this, a small but powerful model. <laughs> Take a look All right, at this! Alright, time for your cross-examination! But I warn you! Okay, sorry. 
Make the witness cry again and you'll feel the wrath of my gavel in your butthole! Jesus Christ. Hey! God, this judge. Yeah, so I should note that this is a point where if you press wrongly, uh, shit hits the fan. So, no! That was, a, that was a problem in Recipe for Turnabout. Why is that a problem here? Yeah. Okay, fine. I don't want to press wrong because fuck the judge. That's so that's, safe. That. What? I don't. I don't think it's necessary right now. Here's I don't know. There's two people standing on the suspension bridge. Suddenly they started fighting. That's what the. Okay, this is cloud of suspicion right here. What? Yeah, that's a cloud of suspicion. I wouldn't. Let's take a look at the photo real quick. Let's just see it. They were just. They were just standing there. They started fighting. Yeah, that's a picture of the crucial there. moment. Yeah, they're just standing there. Menacingly! Wait, wait, get out of there, SpongeBob! Does he. Wait, he does. Does, that, does the defendant not have shoes on? No, he has shoes on. <laughs> but they look like socks. It looks, it looks like, like socks. It looks like he's using his bare feet. <laughs> That'd be painful, but. That would be painful. I... Yeah, but this is not a crucial moment, right? Here. Also, he's still holding his the chain ball. Yeah, he just escaped, that's why. I know. I would present that, honestly. Objection! Yes. Okay. Witness. When you Relative said you took a, the a photo of the crucial moment, is this what you mean, Mint? Uh. Well, all I can see in this photo is... are the t two people facing each other. You testified that you saw the two of them staring to fight. Starting to fight. Starting to fight, excuse me. Normally, that's Starting the kind of fight. thing we would refer to as a crucial moment. Why haven't you presented a photo like that? Well, well you see... The photo we presented was the only one there was. But if you really wanted to, recap to capture the crucial moment, then what happened next? You must have taken a photo of it. <laughs> don't! Don't! <laughs> No! 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 <laughs> Not scribble last night! No! What? <laughs> he said he no, said it! He said it! Don't! Do oh, I miss! Don't! <laughs> er, uh, my apologies, young lady. Don't! <laughs> but Miss Faye's assertion is not without a certain amount of merit. He could certainly downplay the situation, can't he? What? I'm sorry. I'm a really bad girl. Don't, I'm say, really don't bad say that. Yeah, Jesus you Christ, are. don't say that. Yeah, you are. Shut up. I am. I used it all up. The film, I mean. You ran out of film? Hey, this was. This photo was the last one. What? No. <laughs> Unfortunately, that is the truth. I personally examined all the f all the photographs you took that day. All the other photos are the witness herself, playing with one with the flower. Along with the flower. The witness herself then took the fo then who took the photos? Um, you see my camera my camera has a camera feature built into it. So you took photos of yourself. I remember taking some photos of myself once too! We don't need to know that. Please, no details. It seems that Miss Faye's assertion that no one was decisive after all. Uh... Wait just a minute. Well, if she had no film left, she couldn't very well take more pictures, eh? Mr. Foster. Mr. Foster? Miss Foster, perhaps then you could tell us about a dif different sort of photo. Photos of the incident that t you took with your very own eye. Mr. Edgewith, you're quite cool, what, the poet. Very well then, let's get back to the cross-examination. Let's hear your thoughts on the fight you, that you witnessed! Yes, Mr. Judge. Boy, this Mr. guy Judge. really is a sucker for sweet talk. 
Lord. Oh, sorry. It looks like the other kitten in the room is the one that's getting all the attention. Yeah, it's sickening. I was using my camera to take some pictures of the wildlife. Wait, 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 wait this, is, in the this is the exact same cross. This is, not... is it? Yeah, it is. It's not. It's... Oh, is it? She got only. She it's got. Like, she only that's, got. That's new. She only uh, got a ten yards before she was. She. Ten yards I... before she was stabbed in the back. Five, hold on, five yards, look at that, on the, on the left, five yards. Okay, so, double that here, so it's about... Hmm. I, I don't know if that I'm not sure what to think of this. That's, a, that's 12 yards. Wow, okay. The bridge uh, located 40 feet above the... Camera. Can we look at the camera? No. Uh, so Foster took the wind. There's a timer. Time okay, I was hoping for more information about the timer, but okay. Fortunately, there wasn't. Who with my impression? It's brand new and sparkles in the light. Wait, can I see the map one more time? Um. She was okay. right next. She was right there next to e uh, Eagle. Where Eagle River is, she's a little bit too <laughs> I like left. how Nick... I like she, how Nick says, like, was... it's right there. It's right can't... there, you can clearly see it. I have a mouse right here to look, but you guys can't see the mouse. <laughs> yeah, that's... Yeah, we can't see it. <laughs> it's right next to... It's uh, Nick, Eagle, what are you doing? Eagle River. Wait, can I see what she said one more time? Go back and see what she said. She only got she about ten yards before she was stabbed in the back. Previous statement. Oh. Go back one. The victim turned around and turned tried. around to run away. Okay, so but the okay, so do me a favor and look at the photo. Wait, right, yeah. yeah, check out the crime photo. No, not that one. Uh, the wi no, the witness photo. Uh, no, no, yeah, you're right. The witness photo. I it's like the same. So if yeah. she turned around and ran away, she would fall down. She yeah, she would have yeah. fallen down. So present the uh, map on this statement. Objection! Yeah, because she would have fallen down. <laughs> Witness, your testimony is a joke. I'm... I'm not funny, didn't laugh? <laughs> <laughs> not um, funny! Huh? What? Didn't laugh! But I just... I nah. just... Miss Faye, I thought I warned you not to make the witness cry! Your Honor, I thought you were going to become a better adult. Double <laughs> penalty! Oh, I'm sorry. Did I have an actual contradict- I have a evidence to contradict this. One short testimony, <laughs> two bad contradictions, a joke of a witness, and a basket full of weeds. There's no possible excuse! Sense. You say there were two contradictions? It's simple, just take a look at the diagram of the area. According to her testimony, the two of them were in, a mi in the middle of the bridge. But if they were, and but if they were, and the victim had turned around and tried to run, well then. Yeah. Sh she would have hit a dead end! You said ten yards, but she couldn't have ran even five. Because Dusty Bridges collapsed on that side. <laughs> what does this all mean? It's very simple, Your Honor. This charming little witness told a charming little <laughs> lie. That's and all there is like to your it. Charming little tits. <laughs> This beautiful young lady has been lying to the court! Objection! Objection! Who's the moment, Your Honor? Mr. Edgeworth. I completely forgot he was there. <laughs> <laughs> Your Honor, 
allow me to it, it, pers personally it, apologize, for, apologize for the confusion. Sorry. Oh, <laughs> what do you mean? I mean, this I mean, song's I mean, not allowed. There's there's one huge copyright. There's one major mistake in this. What did you say? What are you referring to? It's all because it's because the Stiacar was made after the incident occurred. It's a very old bridge. We couldn't find any official blueprints on it of it. So okay, he's 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 alleging that the bridge was full, complete. So so you're saying? I'm saying that even through the bridge completely is disrepair. No, no, no! There's no evidence that can prove that the bridge was broken during that incident. That's ridiculous! You can actually tell the bridge, br the condition of the bridge from this photo. I apologize, po apologize to the court for not being more clear when I present the evidence. Ha, <laughs> 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 that guy's good. It's a copy, right? It's also huh? <laughs> What yes. do you mean? He planned it from the beginning. He's a genius, all right. That diagram of the bridge was sure. <laughs> what? That coward! How does that make me a coward? <laughs> well, Miss Faye, it seems you've once again made a reckless accusation. Uh, what? I'm so, I'm so, so sorry. I should have been more careful myself. No, 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 no. It wasn't your fault at all. Now then, shall we go on with the trial? I'd like to establish one and for all what it was that the witness... Soul. Indeed. All right, young lady. May I ask you, please, come with me to my private chambers and proceed with your testimony? No. No. But I. It's so hard to go on. I'll give you something hard. We're all on your side, Miss <laughs> Foster. Oh God. There's no need to worry. Just tell us what you saw. Yes, sir. Whatever. Well, tell, Whatever. tell her what we saw next time on Phoenix Wright.